guys welcome back to my channel my name is Jasmine if you're new here if you're not new here then welcome back I'm glad to have you today is another beautiful day you are beautiful and I'm excited to do this look with y'all today um, so this is the look that I am going over and then we also go over uh, my face routine today as well um, so if you want to see how I did that then just keep watching but don't forget to like and subscribe so I'm going to be using the Carnival XL Pro Palette today. I'm going to be going in with the color um, Persuasion. I'm just taking a small fluffy blending brush to pack that in. I'm going in with a Morphe M506 brush. Now I'm going to go in with the color Funky. It's this like hot pink color right here. Okay, now I'm going to go in with Keen, the yellow shade in this palette. Okay, and then now I'm just going to go back in and go in back with each color just to blend everything together. So I went in with Reckless, a dark like purpley brown and just used it to make it just a little bit darker. And I made sure everything was blended out. Um, so now I'm just going to take some Vaseline, cut out the shape of the crease I want, and then I'll be right back. Okay, so I cut out the shape of the crease I want. Um, I think we're going to go for like a halo kind of style eye. So now I'm just going to go back in with the colors Reckless and Persuasion and just kind of reshape what I'm going for. Now I'm going in with Funky, that hot pink. I'm going to jump over to the Norvina palette. This is the... Pro Pigment Palette Volume 1, I'm just going to jump in with the white shade. Okay, so I'm just going to go in with a little bit of black gel liner. This one is Jet from Anastasia Beverly Hills. I'm just going to go in and kind of just leave it really close to my lash line just so it blends when I put my lashes on. I'm gonna go in with a little bit of mascara. The mascara I'm using is the Knobloch Cosmetics Major Pleasure Mascara. using today are from Island Mink Lashes. This is what the packaging looks like. I think this is her older packaging. She's about to change. Um, the lashes I'm going in with today are in the style Creole. They're these super fluffy, really pretty lashes. 
You guys want to go check out anything on her website, you can use the code IMLJASMINE15 and it'll save you a little bit on there. Um, right now I think all her lashes are sold out, but she has a palette coming very soon, some new stuff coming, new lashes, she'll be restocking a bunch of the lashes. Um, so be sure to check her out. I'll link her Instagrams below and her website if I can. And so yeah. So now I'm just going to wait and let my lash glue get tacky and then I'll be right back. Okay, so I went ahead and applied the lashes off camera and now we're ready to get into face. I wasn't going to film face, but I tried something new the other day and I was kind of obsessed. So I wanted to go ahead and do it again, but show you guys it on camera. Um, so I'm first starting off with the Touch and Soul Glassy Skin Primer. Okay, so now I'm going to tell you what I tried the other day. So I bought the e.l.f. 16 Hour Camo Concealer Matte Finish um, I didn't realize there was a hydrating one, so I'm definitely going to have to grab that one to try. Um, but I really, really liked how this one looked the other day. Um, I think I got, this is in light sand. It might be a little too light, but it's okay. Um, so I'm just going to go in with my concealer. Look how full coverage this stuff is. Like, do you guys see that? I can't get over it. So now I'm going to go in with the Wet n Wild Double Ended Contour Stick. Um, this one is in medium tan. Okay, so now I'm going to go in with my Fenty Beauty Hydrating Foundation. I'm using the shade 260. I'm just going to go in with the tiniest bit of concealer. Now for powder, I'm going in with the Fenty Beauty powder in the shade or color Butter. I'm going in with my Morphe Brontour in Vlogger. Okay, so to finish off the eyes, I'm going to go in with Reckless and put that underneath. Putting that out with Persuasion. Now I'm going to dip into just a tiny, tiny bit of Funky. Now going in with Keen, that yellow. I'm going to go in with the P. Louise Acid Rain Paint and Nitro. I'm just going to take a tiny bit of it to apply to my waterline just to give this look a little bit of pop. Gonna go in with the same mascara. Now for blush, I'm going in with the Note Cosmetics blush in Desert Rose. Okay, 
Now for highlighter, I'm going to be going in with the Gold Luxe Highlight from the Carnival Palette. So now I'm going to spray my face. I'm going in with the Morphe Luminous Setting Spray. And if you want to make your highlight pop just a little bit more, you can dab back into your highlighter. While your setting spray is still wet, just pop on a little bit more. Look at that. Also going to apply Gold Lux into my inner corner. Alright, I'm going to go fix my hair and I'll be back with the finished look. Alright y'all, this is the finished look and it is not where I was going. I was going for a pink look and we ended up with sunset colors again. It's fine, it's fine. It looks really good. I really enjoy it. Um, we changed up the lips for once. We didn't do nude um, even though I did something different in my last look. Um, but I really enjoyed it. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. If you have any questions whatsoever, please feel free to comment down below and I'll be sure to get back with you. Um, if there's any videos you want to see, let me know. Um, but yeah, so I think that's it for today and I'll catch you in my next video. Bye.